back to KP's Kingdom, cooking with KP. Today I'm going to show you how I make these amazing braised sausages with pear and potatoes. This tastes absolutely amazing and it's a one pan dish. Let's go, let's get on with it. Here I've got around about half a cup of chicken stock, add about a quarter cup of sweet chili sauce. I'm actually using a Vietnamese dipping sauce there, about two tablespoons worth of apple cider vinegar two cloves of garlic or the equivalent of using my trusty paste give that a bit of a stir around and that is done all we need to do now is set that aside and wait until the right moment a bit of olive oil into a pan on it goes make sure you get that pan around about a medium heat and i'm just going to add my sausages in i'm using a nice little fat pork sausage thought that would be a really nice flavor I want to brown these up so just keep turning those around and try and get them uh, nice and uniform try and get the color on all sides like I'm doing right there if you turn them often enough they won't curl too much either we want to just get those nice and brown we don't want to cook them through all the way put those straight into a different little pan just or plate just to uh, let them sit and uh, get themselves together I've got one red onion which I've just cut into wedges which is actually six pieces really interesting way how to cut those all right put those in I'm going to put in around about five sort of medium-sized potatoes cut into wedges they can go straight into that oil as well keep an eye on your heat as you go and I've got one large pear also cut into wedges okay so they're going to be all around about the same sort of size and the pear mixed with the uh, potato the onion and the rest of everything going in is amazing about about five to eight minutes later i'm going to put in a parsnip i've just cut those into little parsnip chips good dose of freshly ground black pepper that goes straight over the top use as much or little as you like we can now put our little uh, sausages back into that pan just like i'm doing right there and this is such a nice meal put that little stock mixture and uh, sauce mixture that we made earlier pour that straight over the top just like that and all we have to do now is sit and wait for it to cook cover that let that cook off for around about eight to ten minutes ish and we should be looking a little bit like that okay how easy is this to do and if you haven't tried mixing fruit with uh, your cooking before you don't know what you're missing it's a really different flavor gives you a little bit of sweetness and all the rest of it and it's healthy for you as well I'm going to uh, just to decorate this with a little bit of fresh parsley sprigs that i've grabbed out of the uh, father-in-law's garden and look how pretty does that look Thank you so much for watching this video. Really do appreciate it. Love to see you try and make this one at home. Please share this video with all your friends on all platforms and social media. We're trying to get the name of KP's Kingdom out there. Hit that notification bell. You'll be notified every time a new video goes up. More importantly, you want to learn how to cook something new. No fuss. No care. Just like this. You need to come and join the family. My family. Hit that subscribe button. You'll never miss another one of my videos again. All right. I've put these braised sausages with pear and potatoes, and I'm going to enjoy it, I know, and I will catch you next time. Bye!